Dear students, welcome to your Maths Guide. This is question number 7 exercise 13.2. A solid consisting of a right circular cone of height 120 cm and radius 60 cm standing on a hemisphere of radius 60 cm is placed upright in a right circular cylinder full of water such that it touches the bottom. Find the volume of water left in the cylinder if the radius of the cylinder is 60 cm and its height is 180 cm. The cylinder is full of water and the solid is placed inside the cylinder such that the solid touches the bottom of the cylinder. The height of the cylinder is 180 cm and the height of the conical part of the solid is 120 cm. Here the radii of the cylinder and the conical and hemispherical parts of the solid are same which is 60 cm. The cylinder is full of water so the volume of water in the cylinder is equal to the volume of the cylinder. Volume of the cylinder is pi r square h. Here we take capital H as the height of the cylinder. Now the volume of water flows out is equal to the volume of the solid. The volume of the solid is the sum of the volumes of this conical and the hemispherical part. Volume of the cone is 1 by 3 pi r square h and the volume of the hemisphere is 2 by 3 pi r cube. Here 1 by 3 pi r square is common. So 1 by 3 pi r square inside the bracket h plus 2r. Now to find the volume of the water left in the cylinder, subtract the volume of this solid from the volume of the water in the cylinder. Volume of water in the cylinder is pi r square h minus the volume of the solid is 1 by 3 pi r square into h plus 2 r. Here pi r square is common. So pi r square inside the bracket capital H minus 1 by 3 into H plus 2R. By giving values 22 by 7 into radius is 60, 60 into 16. Height of the cylinder is 180 cm minus 1 by 3 into height of the cone is 120 cm plus 2R, 2 into 60. Multiplying 22 by 7 into 60 into 60, we get 792 into 100 by 7. Here 2 into 60 is 120. 120 plus 120 is 240. 240 divided by 3 is 80. So inside the bracket, we get 180 minus 80. Dividing 792 by 7, we get 113.14. Into 100, 180 minus 80 is 100, which is equal to 113.14 into 10,000 centimeter cube. To convert into meter cube, divide by cube of 100. So 113.14 
into 10,000 divided by 10 lakh. Cancel this 10,000 by 10 lakh. Dividing by 100, we get 1.131 approximately. The volume of water left in the cylinder is 1.131 meter cube approximately. If this video is useful, please share it to your friends and to get more videos on time, please subscribe to the channel.